And welcome back to Flexible Games, where we are playing Dig or Die. All right, making some progress here. I've got some, uh, I've got some stuff, some stuff and things. Uh, first of all, I have enough Black Dweller shells finally to make some Black Dweller armor. So there's my Black Dweller armor. Awesome. Reduces damage by four, which is also awesome. Uh, let's see what we need here. We have enough for a laser gun, but let's see what other goodies that we might be able to, to get ourselves here. Uh, the Gatling laser would be a sweet, sweet thing to get, but we need uranium in order to get that. So how do we find uranium? Well, uh, I'm thinking we're gonna we're gonna come down here and we're gonna get the rare metals detector so if we look at that in our inventory there it is way up here devices come down here okay so that is what it takes you basically have it selected and click on it and it will send out a little pulse and uh, tell you where the where the rare metals are. And I don't I mean it doesn't do all metals. So if you look at this, uh, metals like gold, uranium, thorium. So those, I mean, those are going to be handy to find uh, easily. Uh, we may want some large health potions because we've got some more bosses to to attend to here, and. It's going gonna, it's gonna to be tough. It's going to be really tough. Uh, the laser gun, I kind of want to... I don't know if I want the laser gun or if I want, you know, to save up for the, like, the Gatling laser. I think that would be... I think that would be awesome to get the Gatling laser gun. Uh, because it's, you know, fire rate 10 per second versus 4.5 per second. So over twice the fire rate i think that's gonna be nice uh all right i also want this rebreather but the we need we need shark fish skins and i think we're gonna have to go back to the cavern one of the things that is causing some some issues with me here is uh you know when i record uh, i only have so many hours in the day and uh, restarting after i die has become kind of a problem and as we as we venture into the game here, I kind of want to show, you know, the game beginning to end. And you can pick whatever, you know, difficulty you are comfortable with. But again, we are, this channel is Flexible Games. So what I'm going to do is we are going to set param m respawn delay to like 3. Uh, oh, I need uh, equals three. Yeah, achievements have been deactivated. That's fine. I'm, I'm not concerned with that. So now when we die, uh, we'll be able to respawn. The negative one that it was set at means permanent death. You, there is no respawn. And uh, this is just a way for if I die, uh, not to have to redo a bunch of work. Because... We're go coming into the part of the game where we're, we're basically having to face off boss after boss after boss. And uh, yeah, I built a little uh, a little setup here. Let's uh, get our big gun out. Get all these guys lined up. Boink. <laughs> I wanted a big water tank here. Try to make things work. Um... Uh, I don't like that that is they should be able to jump up that they, they kind of derp out sometimes so yeah uh, and I know people might cry foul about that and uh, you know I apologize but it is what it is this is I've only got so many hours in the day and I can't look at all the stuff that's growing up here beautiful somebody said that that the uh, black grass can only spawn, or, you know, it only grows at a certain depth, but I, 
call shenanigans on that. I'm getting tons of it down here. So, I've got this little tank here, and this is, you know, really meant for uh, growing things. And it looks like... Oh, there's a regenerator. I want that. Oh, let's breathe. Breathe, breathe, breathe. Okay, the other thing I would like to do over here... I need to grow some stuff. Breathe. Oh, we are at nighttime. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. Get my big gun out. This thing has a long cooldown time, but. Oh, look at that. He didn't even get to shoot. Nice. Now, you know, they, they can, they can uh, kind of punch through that little reservoir over there. Still trying to figure out a way. To get that to uh, to work without without getting destroyed every time would be nice. I'm gonna take you out. Take you out. I don't want a whole bunch of those coming at us because they do a lot of damage, a lot of damage. So if you get if they time it just perfectly where they flutter in, you know, two or three in a row. Uh, we would likely have a bad time with that. I've also got another big turret up here, so... Yeah, those, uh, those gray... Oh, yeah, that one just about took it out. Woo! Just about took it out. Uh, I might want... Hmm, not sure what I want to do about that. Haha! -ha. Got him. These, yeah, these gray ones are. These gave, gray ones are really tough. Come here, boys. That's oink. I like that this gun goes through. Ow. I like this is good. this gun goes through enemies and it takes you know continues to take out enemies. Oh yep, this drained out. This obviously for some reason. Really? You just need to go away. Yeah, I'm not sure. I'm not sure how to prevent them from digging through that, other than you know, adding adding layers to the to the wall there. Ooh, there's a black piranha right there. I want you. Ow, ow, ow! Here, boys. Ha ha ha! Four in a row. That's what I call a good shot. Okay, well, hopefully this will prevent them from trying to burrow through there. Maybe not. Yeah, I want to try to get a nice big tank here to, to grow some stuff, to sort of spawn those black piranha, uh, all that kind of stuff. So let's see. I have a few of these sea tree seeds. I kind of want to plant some of these. I'm not sure if there's a depth limit. I tried to plant some down here, but it looks like they disappeared on me. So yeah, that is where we're going with that. So now, I think the next boss we want to get is in that volcano, or that big mountain thing way to the east that we saw. I think there's an enemy in there. I've got lots of platforms. Got some health. Regen. Let's let's craft some. Uh, we yeah. See, that's kind of why I want to grow some of those plants because the tree seed, sea tree seed. 
Uh, precision. There it is. Big health. Okay. So large health potion. Uh, right down here. So let's go see what this guy's all about. Uh. As you can see, I kind of already found my way through here. Aha! Oh no! Oh! Uh, regen potion, please. Ah! Uh, that was that one hurt. Whoa! actually taking out that block. Kind of dug himself into a hole now. Oh no, don't, don't fall in there. No! Got him! Oh, how did I not die there? How did I not die right there? Oh, I got him. I can't believe I didn't die right there. That was... That was amazing. platforms over here. I actually snuck up in here trying to get out. I accidentally fell down here and I just kind of skirted the outside trying to find a way out. As you can see, I did I did manage to find my way out, but it was quite the task. So that is the black, I think the the dweller boss. I actually don't know what we got from him. I've got too many enemies around me right now. Aha! Well, that armor certainly helped. That armor helped tremendously. Let's see if this kicked back. There we go. Okay, I just need to get... Just need to get out of here. Some more of these, thank you very much. I'm out of here. See you later, guys. Let's go see what we got. I want to kind of get to the owie. Owie. Okay, let's not fall down there again. That would not be good. Let's uh, take ourselves, get, our, get ourselves off of that gun, because, uh, yeah, that gun's a little bit of a kickback on that thing. All right, so we got that boss. I'm not really sure what he gave us or what it's used for. So 
let's take a peek. First of all, let's see what, what he might have given us. Uh, there it is. Dweller Lord Shell Spike. So, is there anything in here that uses that? I'm not seeing it offhand, which is kind of weird. Uh, yeah, I'm not seeing any sort of indication of the Dweller Lord Shell Spike in here. Maybe it's up a little further. Maybe we should have taken it out sooner. Uh, I'm not seeing, yeah, I'm not seeing the giant shell in here anyway. Uh, yeah, I guess, well, we'll, we'll hang on to it. You know, I'm, I'm guessing it's used for something important. I wish it, I wish I could like upgrade my armor, but, uh, the ant armor, ooh, that is, that requires ant shells. And I happen to know where we need to go for that. Energy Master Gem. The large gem that only the gigantic leaders of the fireflies have. Yeah, that is something we're going to want. Uh, but first, I think we're going to go for this rebreather thing. And we need to go find some sharks. And I am thinking that, yeah, we're going to go down to the underwater ocean again. And uh, we might be able to use our rare ores finder to sort of find what we're go what we're looking for. Uh, we also, yeah, so that is sort of the name of the game going forward. And we've got another night coming, and I'm kind of not wanting to venture out right now. Because, you know, even though we've got some, some good potions and stuff on us, um, I kind of want, what, what's the take for, for those health regen potions? Uh, oh, we got, we got lots of blue flower. And I could really go ham on some of these repair turrets. I, what I should do, honestly, is... Yeah, I should pepper the outside of this with turrets, but those those gray guys do so much damage that it is kind of, I don't know, it's not really worthless, but not really worth putting so many turrets out because we would need so many uh, of the repair turrets. And uh, the... The other kind of repair turret, the bigger ones, we use the black piranha. And those that's kind of why I built that giant pool over here. To see if we could get some of those. And I've I've there have been a couple that have spawned in there. See like this right here is like really bad. Yeah, they already took that turret out right in front there. So if we I want another one of these. And Gatling turret. These are a little tougher. There we go. And I might want to do another repair turret here. Because we're, we're coming up to it here. Uh, I would love to do an advanced repair turret. That would be nice to have right right here. It would be great to have one of those. Aha! Gotcha. Uh, let's see. Black Piranha. Yeah, I just need to go hunt some more of those. Oh. Gotcha, both. Both y'alls. Ow. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. What I should do, um, and uh, a, a good old, a good member uh, has told me, uh, I should uh, dig straight down from this, this res, oh, let's uh, not go that far down. Come on. 
from here, dig straight down and add another... Put another reservoir down. Oh, man. This guy's a little tougher. Boy, it just seems that I can't get a moment's rest out here. Okay. Well, looks like they sort of left... Left this alone. Are there any black piranha in here? Uh, this way. There we go. I'm not seeing any. There, there have been some that have that have uh, spawned in here, so I know it's possible for them to. But anyway, we got uh, things to do, and I would like. Really? Okay, so if we dig, like, straight down from here, right? Uh, let's get my shotgun ready. Oh, hello. Underwater plants that are not underwater. So, this is obviously where, where we're expected to go. Oh, there's some iron. I kind of... I'm trying to get the, the metals as I find them, just so I have them. Okay, obviously there's some more. Okay, enough of that. Enough of that. Okay. Keep keep our keep our breathing good here. I love that rebreather. That would be epically awesome to have one of those. And we are quickly going through a lot of stone right there. Oh breath. Wow, look at all that stone. Okay. Breathing. Important. Get out of here. Oh, wow. Okay. Everybody needs to die. Because that was a lot of enemies right there. A lot of enemies. Okay. Oh. Take you out. Come here, dude. Boink. Oh, what? Got him. All right. Well, I'm gonna dig this channel, and uh, we'll can we'll pick it up next episode. So I thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.